There are two broad general categories of enhanced efficiency nitrogen fertilizers or EEFs and these consist of either chemical additives that we add to the fertilizer, we call those stabilizers or inhibitors, and the second group is what we call slow or control release fertilizers. The first group, the inhibitors or stabilizers, are chemicals that are added to the fertilizer that slow the rate of transformation of one form of nitrogen to another, thereby reducing the exposure of a particular form of nitrogen to a specific loss mechanism. The slow and control release fertilizers work by slowing the rate of nitrogen release into the soil. We're not altering the chemistry of that nitrogen, but we're reducing the exposure, reducing the amount of nitrogen that's exposed at any point in time. But they may also differ in the time that they're effective and how we would use them. For example, a urease inhibitor is one of these stabilizers or inhibitors that we might use. It slows the conversion of urea to ammonium, thereby reducing volatilization losses. They're effective really for a fairly short period of time, say a week to a couple of weeks. The slow and control release fertilizers may release over a period of a few weeks to a period of even many months in some cases. So they achieve many of the same benefits, but by different modes of action.